good morning everyone this is Sandeep Dahiya and this is my third video in exchange series and today in this video I am going to explain you about how to create share policy in exchange 2030 Be before that I simply want to tell you what exactly share policy is share policy is used for sharing the calendar information within or outside the organization so in exchange 2013 we have two ways for creating a share policy one you can use exchange administration center for creating a share policy and second option is exchange management shell and today we'll see the demonstration of both of the ways and how we can select that policy or how we can set that policy as a default policy for the users so let's uh, start with the demo so for creating a sharing policy first you need to log into uh, the exchange administration center in exchange administration center you'll select a particular user right then add it and uh, in the user property you'll find out uh, mailbox features in mailbox feature you find out uh, default sharing policy right so now uh, I'm going to create a new policy right here and which I want uh, the user to be used for calendar sharing how I can do that so first for that I have to click on the organization tab in EAC in the organization tab we'll find out sharing yeah, under the sharing we'll find out individual sharing right and for that you have to click on the plus right in the plus I just want to create open share open share policy right uh, then I click define sharing rule for this policy then I click on that now I'm having the option to create a share policy for all the domains or create a share policy for a specific domains for right now I'm selecting the option for all the domains because I, I don't want to bound might be I am having more than one domain associated with me and I want uh, the user need to share the calendar information with all the trusted different domains and forests and then uh, the option below mention option you need to select calendar free busy information with time only calendar free busy information with time subjects and locations I just want to select this particular option right and then uh, share your contact folder I don't want to select this because I just want to share my uh, calendar information then I simply click on save right then now uh, I'm having two choice I can make this policy as a default policy so every by default it's uh, become mandatory for all user to use the this policy as a main policy or second options I can go to a user property and specify this policy for some set of users those are interacting with outside and they need to have this policy right so now I'm not making this policy as a default policy but I want to go to the user property and want to select this policy as a default policy for specific users so simply I have to click on save now I'm having two policies here and I want to use at uh, one user to use this particular policy for that I need to go to recipients in recipient I need to select a particular recipient and click on add it when I click on the add it then I have to go to mailbox feature in the mailbox feature I have to click here and I have to select open share right and then save now this Amar is going to use this policy uh, as a this uh, will use this sharing policies rather than using the default policy okay now I'm going to tell you the another way for creating the share policy for that we have to open the exchange management shell in this exchange management shell we have to run a command uh, the command is new hyphen sharing policy hyphen name anonymous and the domain and the calendar busy information enable and true so uh, when I run this particular command 
this command will create a policy right for anonymous and we have to enable this on the virtual directory right so uh, now I'm going to close this command right and uh, I need to refresh here right and then go to uh, the organization in organization go to individual sharing and we'll find out there is a new policy and I want to select this policy for another user simply I have to go to another user uh, name is Anil and simply add it and go to mailbox feature and then click here and need to select this policy right save I just want to simply want to uh, show you the difference between the policy which we have created from the EAC and the policy which I have created from the e exchange management shell so simply you have to go to the second policy which I have created here then added this policy and in the policy you just simply see uh, uh, what is selected you can click here and you'll able to see the policy is for anonymous domain right and this policy is simply uh, for a specific domain and the policy which I have created from the exchange administration center was for every every outside domain and forest that is the difference now we have selected two users for using the policy right so uh, this is I, I hope this video is informative for you and for further review we'll able to uh, uh, give your feedback uh, and uh, please contact me if you need any other video for exchange 2013 thank you very much